I didn't decide to be a director until I was living in Los Angeles and it was the year 2020. But that happened while I had this screenplay, now titled The Queen of My Dreams, but it was in the TIFF Writers Studio in Toronto. All the other people in the program, the writer directors were like, you're talking like a director, why aren't you directing this? And at that point I'd been looking for someone to direct. And then I realized that, you know what, I was looking for me. So I went to law school in Chicago and I took the bar exam and I passed, but then I decided not to apply for a job right away and I decided to pursue an acting career. I was inspired by a class I'd taken in law school and I was just like, oh yeah, this is my career path. Then I realized that I needed a job and so my marketable skill was being a lawyer. So I got a job at a kind of mid-sized firm doing really big cases. I was a civil defense litigator, but from day one, I was lawyering by day and acting by night. It was through auditioning that I realized that there really weren't great roles for someone who was Muslim or Muslim and South Asian or Muslim and South Asian women or someone also who was queer on top of all those identities. So I started writing and I made the decision to direct The Queen of My Dreams. I stopped acting in 2020, it's sort of been full steam ahead since. We're excited for the U.S. premiere of the film, which is happening at South by Southwest. I'm inspired by Bollywood films, and there's a romance and a richness and a beauty and a fantasy that I really wanted to capture in every part of this movie. I had a really supporting producing team and supportive of us going to Pakistan to film, which was a non-negotiable for me. When you haven't made a feature film, you're often not daunted until after the fact. You're like, how did I do that? or I can't believe I did that, or now I understand why people make their first feature in two locations with two people in one city and one country. We're collaborating with Cineplex Pictures for a Canadian theatrical, which will be happening on March 22nd at Cineplex Theatres across Canada. Come see the movie at a Cineplex near you.